One of the key reasons for making this series of video clips is because of the recession. So what are the key lessons about what you do during a recession? So. Don't spend. And I know that the government don't want to hear that at the moment, but that's literally what it means. Right. You, don't it, spend on what? On whatever you don't need. You know, you don't buy a new car just because the accountant says that you need to have more tax deductions. Right. You buy a new car when you need a new car. If the other car's fine, keep, keep driving the other car. You know, why lay out more money if, if the car you've got's perfectly fine? Why buy a new plasma TV? You know, just stick with the old ones. I think there's a real danger for people to think we can just take another 20000 or we can just buy another car. Right. Whereas because we lived through a recession of paying 17%, yeah. we've been very careful how we actually spend excess money. Even though the banks say we can lend you more, we don't necessarily want oh, so to use that line of credit. Okay. When you're self-employed, you have to keep the... The mm. cash has to be available for making those payments. We mm. can't afford not to pay our insurance. And you have to be smart, uh, identify uh, what are the weaknesses in your business, and then you get rid of those weaknesses and maybe want to add another thing that you think that will bring in traffic, uh, you know, increasing your sales, overall sales. So that, that is uh, important, uh, just to reinvent yourself. The tough times. Well, I I haven't at the moment. I'm I haven't felt it as much as other businesses would have because I do have a large clientele that are very loyal to me. Um, but I just got to keep my head up and just keep going, keep going, and just do what I do. Haircuts. Everyone needs a haircut. So whether they wait a week or two till they need it done, they'll extend that. But they do always need a haircut, and uh, my prices are very reasonable. Um, they're not through the roof, so and if I keep them at a low through this recession, um, I, I shouldn't have a problem. So what's the, like I said, with the economy, people don't want to spend. At the start, people didn't mind spending a bit more for for yeah. quality produce. But now it's like with the financial crisis at the moment, people are just looking at saving every dollar they can. Yeah. Okay, the important things you got to look at. The owner always has to be in, in the business. Doesn't matter if you've got a manager. All right, my workers take care of the business, but not, but not like me. I think there are real opportunities in the gloomy time for those businesses that are adept on their feet and and can look at themselves quickly and uh, and say, where is an opportunity? I think there is opportunity. Yes. Right. There's three things that you've got to do well at any one time in any business. It doesn't matter what business it is. First off, most of us come to a business with a technical basis, a technical skill. We're a builder, we can build home. The management aspect, which is the day-to-day -day grind of doing the invoicing, the quoting, the responding to the emails. And the third aspect is the entrepreneurial aspect, which is the chase. The chase for new business, the, the looking at yourself, the, the marketing your own business better than you have the previous year. There are opportunities out there. Isn't it? And Mum and I were only discussing a couple of weeks ago that whenever the economy's in recession, we're usually doing quite well out of this business. And whenever the economy's booming along, we're usually struggling. And okay. that's just the way the business has always been. People, people still work, so mm. it, it hasn't impacted, um, it, well, it certainly hasn't impacted on my business anyway. I'm not just a lady that stays at home and looks after and babysits children, yeah. you know. I, I have aspirations and all that sort of stuff and, and I have that thirst f to, to continue to to, to do whatever. You know, I've just applied to become a JP as well. So, <laughs> and that's at the Attorney General's office at the moment. Plan ahead, um, be competitive, lift your game. Um, if you were doing it good before, do it better. Um, Talk to other people that are of are like minded people who uh, are involved in small business and, and um, but the main thing is to make sure that you lower your debt if you possibly can get out of debt. Uh, bring down your overdraft as much as you possibly can, uh, reduce your, your costs, uh, become more efficient.